Okay, this video is just going to be the quick overview of the KOS or Chaos uh, software for the CineDrive motion control system. Uh, like with a lot of other Windows software, you open the upper left hand corner, you have a file. This is where you will load and save your moves. Under the setup menu, you will have basically all your different configurations for motors, uh, network connections, and this type of thing. Uh, help is all, your, all of your man, uh, manuals. Down at the bottom here is where when you connect your axes, they will show up. And you can click on these to select. Uh, this middle area here is our slider. This is what you will use to position the motors, uh, as well as set up the range and its current position within that range. Uh, enabling the keyframe and then these buttons are your fine adjustment bump buttons. Up at the top here is your graph. This is where your keyframes will be displayed along, along with your curves or the path of the movement. And there's some other information here uh, that we'll get into in detail when we get into this section. Over here on your home screen, this is you do all your common stuff like uh, mark begin and end during calibration, record a keyframe, play, stop, save your file, and notes associated with that file. Uh, under the time lapse window, it's basically where you're going to set up your exposure, delay, photos, and all things pertaining to a time lapse. Same with stop motion, again, photos, uh, your current frame position, and all other things that would pertain to your stop motion. Under basic, uh, this is where we're just going to basically set up whether you're reversing to a keyframe or rapid a keyframe. Same thing with home, which home is just your uh, mark begin points of every axis. Looping is just where you set up the different styles of looping if you want to turn on that feature. And you have delay, which is whether you want the, your move to start by a countdown timer or a specific date and time. That pretty much uh, wraps up the quick run through of the software so now we'll get into detail on each specific section.